Hey folks, Mike Klingensmith, All Seasons RV. Today I'm talking about the 2018 Open Range Light 312BHS. Uh, this is a three slide out bunkhouse model. Um, has washer dryer prep, a big outside kitchen on it, um, a lot of big upgrades to it. So I'm going over this product. If you have any questions, feel free to give us a call at our dealership. Telephone number is 330-564-0222 or you can visit our website at www.asrvs.com. And again, my name is Mike Klingensmith. So a little bit about the open range product itself, go over a little construction of it. It is a true four season coach, uh, zero degree tested, and they uh, had the best test results out of any manufacturer out there. So uh, safe to say that this is a true four season coach. Uh, it has a one piece PVC roofing material, which is a white membrane all the way through. You never have to recondition that roof. Um, also, the warranty on that roof is, is a lot better than your traditional rubber roof. So it's a 12 year warranty and 10 years out of that 12 years is 100% prorated, which covers labor and any, any uh, parts involved. Also being a white uh, membrane all the way through, it re reflects heat 50% better than a rubber roof would. So on really hot, sunny days, it will stay a lot cooler inside. Um, also, they have changed the uh, AC unit inside to a domestic, uh, the Medic Whisper Air, so with that AC unit on, you won't even, you won't even hear it running, which is a, another huge plus. Um, so going over this entire product, you have all LED lights inside and out, a nice LED uh, strip lighting up front, and on your power tongue jack, kind of light up uh, when you're hitching up or detaching late at night, early in the morning, because typically that's when uh, you're getting in or out of campgrounds. Uh, comes with two 30-pound propane tanks, which from our dealership, we will fill them. And we will give you a brand new 12 volt Vibrine cycle battery in a box as well up front. Uh, it has stabilizer jacks on all four corners. Uh, just wanted to point that out so we'll get all that shake and shimmy out of it. Uh, all these uh, open ranges are pre-wired for solar panels. Um, what I suggest is getting portable solar panels, not the ones that you put up top of your unit. This way you can actually put them out in the sun, uh, depending where your campsite is. Uh, that is really good for uh, dry camping or, or boondocking as people call it. Uh, basically when you're off the grid, you don't have that power source on the side and you need, you need to keep that 12 volt battery up front charged. Hook up solar panels to this and that's exactly what it'll do. We'll charge your battery up front. Uh, you have a full pass through storage uh, here on the front of the unit with a motion sensor light right there, which is LED. Uh, so it will light up the entire uh, storage compartment all the way through. Has the frameless windows all the way around on this unit. Um, not only does it look good, doesn't leave those nasty black street streaks like uh, typical just normal uh, windows on RVs do because they have that plastic rubber trim around it. This, don't have to worry about that. Full, full power awning, uh, goes the full length of the outside exterior of the coach with a LED strip light right underneath of the uh, awning itself really uh, lighten up the outside of here, uh, outside space. So if you're eating outside or, or the kids are playing cornhole or something late at night, turn those LED lights on and it gives it a good pop and you can actually see what you're doing. As a friction hinge door, uh, good up to 25 mile an hour and it won't slam shut on you. I think a huge plus to these type of doors, um, friction hinge versus just the standard one is there's no tab at the back to lock this door open. So if you forget that that door is locked open and you grab a hole and go to shut it, usually you rip that tag off. Um, this being a friction hinge door, you don't have that. So one less thing you have to worry about. Has the nice aluminum steps, super light, super sturdy, easy to put in and out. They won't stick on you. And again, they're super light, gives a good look. Does have the, the grips on each of the steps so it won't get slippery or anything on wet and uh, cold rainy days. Big oversized grab handle, get in and out. Uh, move to the back of the unit, I'll show you the uh, outside kitchen, which has the upgraded tin countertops to it, so it won't be the, the compressed wood anymore. So if this gets wet, you're not going to have to worry about this swelling up and replacing it and just being another headache. I mean, it is uh, upgraded tin. So you have your two burner cooktop, uh, your uh, outside sink, which is already pre-plumbed to your gray tank, so you don't have to worry about a little drainage nozzle here and all the water kind of spitting out. And a nice mini fridge dorm, uh, dorm fridge outside. Keep all your beverages cold uh, or food, hot dogs, burgers, whatever you want uh, to bring with you. Does have a 110 outlet 
plus your cable hook out uh, hookup out here. So if you want to bring a little TV outside and do a little entertaining, you do all your hookups here. Another big plus to this uh, 110 outlet outside is say you want to uh, you know hook up a little uh, flat skillet out here or a, a crock pot and cook outside instead of inside and heating up the coach inside. Hook it right here and uh, you know to kind of get uh, do cooking. Also, it will come with the uh, grill on the back bumper. It's already fitted with the uh, mount right here for the grill outside, uh, which this unit from us will come with it. Has the dock, universal docking station in the back, which is heated. So this has your outside shower hookup, and it will come with the spray nozzle and the hose. Has your uh, city inlet and your city fill, and then a black tank flush as well to kind of get all that nasty smell and sediment out of your black tank. And again, has three slide outs. Now, Open Range has the deepest slide outs in the entire industry. So you're looking at about a 42 inch deep slide out here versus a 36 or a 38 inch slide out. Um, also, their frames are a bit wider than anybody else in the industry. So they truly will give you more room, more space at less weight. Uh, let's go inside, take a look at the actual floor plan of this, this unit. Uh, right off the bat, Open Range is the only one doing zero carpet throughout their entire camper um, with a flush floor slide out. Now they are the only ones doing the flush floor zero carpet slide out. They have a patent pending on it. Um, so no other company will you see something like this. And again, zero carpet throughout the entire coach, which I think is a great, huge upgrade. Uh, you don't have to worry about spills, uh, pets, uh, kids spilling stuff. I mean, it, it happens, unfortunately. Uh, has a big U-shape lounge dinette with two portable tables. Uh, usually we uh, put the tables underneath. Perfect. And I will show you real quick how to set these tables up. It's real easy, real simple. And again, they store right underneath uh, both sides of the U-shape uh, lounge. Also in here, what I'll, what I'll show you is this will make into a queen size bed. Uh, so additional sleeping. I know this is a bunkhouse model and it, it offers a a lot of sleeping space, but this is just one more spot to, uh, you know, have a sleeper. And again, you have two of these portable tables. You can turn them uh, sideways if you need to get in, if it gets a little tight. And again, setting up and tearing down is super easy. Um, it takes zero time at all. I mean, it's once you once you really know how to do it, it's real easy. Now I will show you the. Uh, queen bed in here. Now these cushions, these three cushions are velcroed on, so just display wise, and just I'm not going to unvelcro them right now. But there's a metal bar right back here. There goes the cushions. And this flips all the way down. That obviously with the cushions off will rest on the ground. Huge area back here. Will It will come with a blow up air mattress and that's where you would sit it. Also under these spots, you have tons of storage under here and there, and there's a 110 outlet. Uh, under this storage compartment. So additional uh, blankets, pillows, anything that you'd probably use for um, this sleeper sofa right here, that would be a good spot to uh, kind of put everything. Let me uh, pop that back. Aren't these cushions fun? <laughs> All right, uh, has your exit, emergency exit window on both sides. Also has the uh, pull down blinds on here uh, versus venation metal blinds or anything like that. So these blinds will pull all the way down, block out that early morning sun or, or late at night if you want a little privacy when you're going to bed, obviously you can pull the blinds down. Now with the open range light, what they've done, they've upgraded the countertops this year. They're no longer doing that uh, compressed for mica boards. They're actually putting real Corian countertops in here. Real stainless steel appliances. So you have a pull down residential spray nozzle. One big bowl residential um, stainless steel sink with a nice bamboo cutting board uh, sink covers. Stainless steel uh, inserts for your refrigerator, which is an oversized uh, refrigerator. It's not your standard 6.3 cubic foot. And again, call us, uh, see exactly what we have in stock, and we'll be more than happy to go over the options and how we've outfitted these because there are a couple different options that you can get. Stainless steel microwave and also stainless steel oven. Um, as you can see here, the TV comes up out of the countertop, which is right across from your seating area over here. Press of a button, goes up and down. So again, 
If you're not watching TV and you just want more counter space, obviously you can put that TV all the way down and you have a huge spot for counter space. Tons of storage all the way around as well for uh, cups, uh, pots and pans drawer right below your, uh, your oven, which I think that's a great uh, little cabinet or uh, drawer to have. A full wall storage here as well, kind of like a little pantry area or a liquor cabinet, however you want to uh, you know, use this storage compartment. Back in the back bunk area, you do have a real door, close the kids off, no curtain, no accordion blind or anything. Has the dinette back here, so if the kids want to come back here and eat, or if they just wanted to sit back here and play games while adults have the adult time out in the uh, living area or outside, they absolutely can do here. And again, you can shut the door and they'll kind of you know, make noise back here and you won't hear them as bad. You have a top bunk. Let me unlock that. There we go. So top bunk with an actual window up top. And Joe, I want you to come in here and show them the size of these uh, bunk mattresses. So these are double wide bunks up top and below. And they do have the teddy bear material on it. So they're real soft. You don't necessarily have to put sheets on here. Um, you should if you want to keep this clean. But again, it's it's that really soft, nice uh, teddy bear material. Also, you have a uh, storage drawer right underneath for all their clothes. More storage to the side as well. Uh, hanging wardrobe up top. And did you show them the ladder right here to get up and down on the bunks? Nice little vent back here because unfortunately sometimes kids can be a little smelly. So nice, it's nice to have the windows open and pop the vent open, get good cross ventilation back there. Does have the fireplace in here as well. So late at night, early in the morning, this is an electric fireplace. So if you didn't want to run your propane furnace and you're on the campgrounds electric anyways, you can pump this guy on and it will radiate heat. Uh, keep this entire coach nice and warm early in the morning, late at night, or if you just don't want to run your propane at all and just use your electric uh, fireplace, that, that's why that's there. It does have a CD, DVD player, radio. Uh, also, that is Bluetooth capable, so if you have Pandora or Spotify on your phone, you can pair it to that radio and play indoor or outdoor on the speakers, because uh, this does have indoor and outdoor speakers on it. Going towards the uh, front of the camper, you have your uh, big spacious bathroom, huge stand-up glass surround shower with a little skylight up above. But this is a, uh, again, you want that room, that arm space, or even the height out of it. I mean, this is this is definitely the, uh, the coach for you with the uh, nice amount of space in the shower. Also, the toilet, I love pointing this out, real porcelain toilet, not a plastic toilet. Has a vanity mirror here, medicine cabinet with tons of storage in the back. Nice stainless steel sink as well in the in the bathroom. Has your vent and your fan up top. Obviously, I kicked that on. With that vent open, it really sucks the air out of here, uh, or the smell, should I say, whatever you're doing in there, the steam. The bed back here is an actual queen mattress. It's 60 by 80, not a short RV queen, which is typically 60 by 74, six inches shorter than a traditional queen. So this is a real 60 by 80 queen size bed. The nice pillow, uh, pillow top mattress, which is foam, uh, very comfortable. Also on the side over here, I like to point out that this does have the uh, laundry hamper chute on it. So if you wanted to stick a little laundry basket down there um, and didn't want all your dirty, stinky clothes in here, obviously you can pop this lid open, throw your clothes in there, and they're out of the way. You do have 110 outlets and a USB port back here uh, for charging phones, tablets, uh, 110 for CPAP machines or, or uh, alarm clocks. Unfortunately, sometimes some people do need alarm clocks in the, uh, at campgrounds, unfortunately, sometimes. Uh, yeah, we'll look in here. This is the, this is where your washer dryer prep is. You want, I could grab that. Here we go. So you have washer dryer prep back here, hot and cold. Uh, 110 GFI back there. Also, if you didn't want the, uh, washer dryer, there is a hanging rod back here and a little shelf up top, uh, for hanging clothes or what have you. And again, if, if, uh, if you wanted the washer dryer, please call, uh, please give us a call. I'll be more than happy to go over the options that we can do washer dryer wise and, and exactly cost and, and give you the, 
the whole price list. Under the bed, it does have full storage under here with the hydraulic struts on it, so you don't have to hold this bed up. It does it on its own. Back under here, this is where we'll keep the, uh, the grill, the air mattress, other little odds and ends to this camper. Um, and again, our dealership, it's all Seasons RV in Streetsboro, Ohio. That's Northeast Ohio. We're about 30 minutes from Cleveland. Um, if you have any questions about this or want to know what else we have in stock or what we can get for you, please feel free to give us a call. Uh, telephone number is 330-564-0222. And again, my name's Mike Klingitsmith. Thanks for watching. Enjoy camping.